morning, Morgan Knoll here with TransWest Truck Trailer RV in Frederick, Colorado, bringing you another inventory item. This is gonna be a 2020 Logan Coach Bullseye four horse gooseneck. We'll take a look at it and see what it's all about. And if you guys have any questions, don't hesitate to ask while we're going through. Um, but Logan Coach is gonna be your galvanized steel frame, aluminum sheeting on the side, aluminum sheet roof. So that galvanized steel, it's not gonna rust. Your aluminum's not gonna rust, so you're, you're not gonna see rust on this trailer. Um, anything that you see in black under here um, and anywhere on the trailer is going to be covered in Logan Coach's Vortex coating. going to kind of be like rhino lining, just more heat resistant to cracks and helps with the strength and integrity of the trailer. So underneath you just have your basic, um, your jack and then your spare tire. We can easily put a hydraulic jack on this one if needed. Our boys back in the shop, they do a really good job with um, keeping stuff looking like it came from the factory that way. But right here, we've got the tack room. We've got a swing out saddle rack, four tier saddle rack. That's gonna be a nice ease of use. You're not having to jump up in there to throw saddles in. I mean, you're right here. And even the top one, like it's not even too bad. And then that swings in. You've got your door with your swing out blanket pole. So this just unhooks and comes out and that way you can stack up blankets and not have to shimmy them on. Door comes with a um, brush box, extra storage space. And then this door is a framed in door. So you're sitting 37 inch wide with 35 inch um, opening. And so uh, you're getting a few extra inches. I think it's a 35. Hold on, sorry. 37 wide 33 inch opening so you're sitting with extra framing on the side an inch and a half on each side so that's going to help it be more heavy duty um, going to be solid and it does have a latch back so that door is not going to blow around in the wind so you get up into the tack room you've just got your basic um, above the neck where you can throw a saddle rack if you needed it or a saddle rack of bed if you needed it. <laughs> um, extra storage space, that's for sure. Right there, you've got a Jiffy Jack. Those are gonna be super easy to have and use when um, you've got a flat going down the road. All you gotta do is pull up that good tire on the same side onto that jack, and then you can easily undo and get that other, the bad tire off and replace it. But behind the saddle rack, you're going to have some extra storage space. We can get a water tank installed right there for you if wanted. And then you're going to have your bridle hooks with your carpeted partition wall. And that carpet's just going to help with the, um, the swaying and the swinging of the bridles. And they're not going to be either ruining your aluminum or they're not going to be um, scuffing themselves up. So we'll come over here to the hip side. You've got four big bus windows. Those are uh, gonna be 20 by 30 bus windows, so pretty big for you. Um, then you have four ties. You got aluminum sheet and then aluminum sheet extrusion. Load light up above. And then down below you've got two 6,000 pound extra torsion axles. So plenty of, plenty of axles under these trailers, that way you can load it up. Um, this trailer is actually sitting at 5,420 pounds empty. Two big back doors. On the back, right here I'll show you, you've got your light switches. So one for the exterior, one for the interior horse area. So that's where your light controls are at. These doors do pop into place. So they're going to be staying out of your way. They're not going to be coming at you. In the stall area, we've got wood floors that are covered in the vortex coating. So wood covered in vortex, nothing's going to get into that wood and seep in and sit and rot. Um, these floors should last you a very long time. The other nice thing about having wood floors is that if one plank's going, all you got to do is replace that one plank. You're not having to redo the whole floor. You can just replace it one at a time if wanted. Um, that vortex coating is going to help with the, but help with not getting water urine seep into there and help it or make it deteriorate. So we've got four dividers. Each divider has pads on both sides. Um, this last one is going to be a telescoping divider. All you got to do is lift this pin, push it in, and then you have the access 
to hook this up and that way you can drive with these open if you want Marin full in this last stall these actually all come over and they all clip together too so if you're using it for other purposes you can have these pushed back not have to worry about them swinging back and forth load your four-wheelers up in here go to the mountains that's what I like to do um, but you've got four load lights so interior lights gonna be nice when you're having to um, when you're having to load in the dark sorry some music just started playing from no out of nowhere and we we had no clue um, but in these you do have roof vents on all four stalls they push forward and backward so get airflow if they're gonna be forward you're gonna be pulling air in if they push backward you're gonna be sucking air out so get that airflow going through here in the hot summers um, I know it's been pretty hot here in Colorado and we're we're ready for that the cold to come through but that way you're keeping your horses cool the latches super easy to use I mean all they do is come through pop in like anything it's got to break in a little more before they start slashers playing in there better but um, really nice latches really ease of use on them the other nice thing about Logan is everything is rounded off you're not having any sharp edges they keep the horses comfort in mind um, definitely really nice to have right here you'll see these three little hooks that's gonna be for a triangle feeder so if you wanted to put a feed um, kind of like a feed bunk in there we can definitely get one for you on the sidewalls, you'll see the vortex coating. So vortex covered sidewalls. And then this trailer does have some minimal hail damage. We did get a hail storm going through. So you like here in Colorado, you never know which afternoon we're gonna be getting hail. So it's kind of nice, it's more savings to you already. And then if it does hail more, I mean, you already have it up there. So it doesn't, doesn't really do anything. <laughs> um, on the head side here you're gonna have another load light so you've got one on each side of the trailer um, it's gonna be nice tacking untacking in the dark you're gonna be able to see you do have to have an external power source to run the lights like we've got a battery pack powered up right now um, either hooked up to your truck or we can install an extra battery for you too so that way you can run those lights um, when you're not hooked up to the truck and then the battery will charge off your truck when it is hooked up so you got drop down windows on all four stalls and then these trailers have the jail bars with the screen the screens gonna help prevent um, bugs and rocks and stuff from getting in your horse's eyes where you're going down the road but these come down as well and it's easier access check on the horses make sure they're good going down the road um, offer them water more feed you can check on them and make sure they're good so nice thing about Logan is everything is one-handed so one-handed to come down and then the outside windows as well one-handed um, these pop into place too so that you can drive with them down going down the road uh, it's gonna be nice to get that airflow going through for the horses definitely but this is a 2020 Logan coach bullseye four horse gooseneck you're sitting seven feet tall six nine wide 18 feet seven and a half inches on the floor those stalls are going to be 36 inches wide and then empty weight of 5,420 pounds, like I said earlier. It's going to be stock number 5N200161. That's 5N200161. Yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please let me know if you have any questions on this trailer or any other trailers we have on the lot. We are here to help you out. Um, if you want to see a walkthrough of any of the trailers we have, please let us know and we'll do that for you. Um, you can contact me, you can call or text me at my cell phone. That's gonna be 970-218-5996. You can call my desk phone at 303-684-3451. Or you can email me at morgan, M-O-R-G-A-N, dot null, K-N-O-L-L, -L, at transus.com. I look forward to hearing from you and look forward to doing business. Have a great day.